Driving in Memphis, you hit more than your fair share of bumps in the road. But it's also been a rocky road for city leaders trying to get the Bluff City repaved. And certain roads really tear up your car a little bit. Um, a lot have been redone in years past, but a lot of others like airways really need work on them. The potholes here are nothing I need to tell you about if you've ever driven in Memphis in the past few years. I hit at least six, seven every day. Same route. They never get fixed. A lot of bumps, a lot of potholes. I'd be glad to get, if they could get that smoothed out a little bit, be easier on my uh, vehicle. It's been a bumpy ride for city leaders. Budget cuts have not helped our roads. The government is paving the way to smoother streets, shifting into high gear by giving Memphis $6 million. Public Works Deputy Director Robert Connect says Airways, Brooks, and Hickory Hill Road are at the top of the fix-it list. We're hoping to generate about 115 lane miles of resurfacing with overall. So there'll be numbers of projects going on and moving forward to get as much work done in, in a timely fashion as quickly as possible. The repaving can't come soon enough for John Currington. I got bad tires because of these roads in Memphis. The city plans to kick in another one and a half million dollars. The Public Works Department will begin resurfacing early next year, weather permitting. In Northeast Memphis, Casey Monroe, CW30 News.